Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the AP EPR channel. Today, we're introducing you to an incredibly powerful AI tool, MyShell. It lets you access GPT-4 Gemini Pro, Claude 3.5, Sonayet, and more without spending a dime. Plus, it features AI image generation, text-to-speech, an AI girlfriend, image enhancement, and other functions to meet all your daily AI needs, significantly boosting your productivity. So how do you start using MyShell? Let's explore together. Sign up and log in. First, visit the MyShell website. The link is in our description. Once there, you need to create a MyShell account. Click the login slash or sign up button and fill in your email, username, and password. After successfully signing up, you can log in. Basic settings, personal profile. The first thing you'll want to do is open your profile in MyShell. Here you can view your basic information and make some initial settings, such as language, time zone, and theme color. Important note, be sure not to enable the NSFW function at work, or you might find yourself in an awkward situation. That wraps up the basic settings. Next, I'll walk you through all of MyShell's features, so stay tuned. Feature one, chat. On the main screen, you'll find MyShell's chatbots, including GPT 3.5, GPT-4, GPT-4.0, and Claude 3.5 Sonnet. Pick any bot, like GPT-4, and you'll see a chat interface where you can ask it questions. Its responses are just like those from OpenAI's GPT-4, and best of all, it's free to use. For instance, you can ask it, are you GPT-4.0? And it'll reply just like OpenAI's GPT-4. You can also have it write articles, code, or do math problems, whatever you need. Excited yet? Click the Explore button and you'll discover a variety of bots designed for different purposes, including multilingual, image, and video modes, and even premium versions from official memberships. These are guaranteed to meet many of your needs. Feature two, creation workshop here. You can create your own personalized bot, featuring popular models and even voice conversations. Here's how, first click create bot. You can set your avatar or name, pick tags you often use, like games, learning, tools, etc. Below, you can write a simple description or greeting for your bot, which is optional. Now for the fun part, model configuration and parameter settings. Choose from various subscription-only closed source models or open source ones. Just remember that different models use different amounts of credits. I'll explain how credits are calculated at the end of the video. Once you've set your prompts, choose a voice you like and save everything. Your custom bot is ready to go. You can ask it anything, and it'll do its best to provide a satisfactory answer. You can also have it tell jokes, sing, or even write code. Keep in mind, it might not be super smart at first, but it'll get to know you better the more you use it. Feature three, reward. Before we dive in, let me explain my shell's energy system. You get 60 energy bars daily for free. Each question you ask a bot uses one bar. If you're using a closed source model, it'll cost more, anywhere from two to 20 bars. So what if you run out of energy? Don't worry, head to the reward center, where you can complete tasks to earn points and exchange them for more energy. And if that sounds like a hassle, we've got a treat for you. In the reward redemption section, find exchange shell coin, switch to the current season, and you can get a premium membership card and a starter pack with 300 energy bars, enough to keep you going for a long time. Feature four, text-to-speech. Now that you've got a handle on MyShell's basics, let's move on to the text-to-speech feature. Switch to chat and find a voice in the explore section in the language you want. There are tons of voice styles to choose from. Pick one and once you're in the chat page, it'll send you a message automatically. Below, you'll see a play button. Click it to listen. <laughs> If you like it, just send your script and it'll generate the audio for you, even correcting any typos along the way. The generated audio can also be downloaded. How cool is that? Finally, MyShell has tons of fun features waiting for you to explore. You can join the community to share your bots with others or buy bots created by other users from the marketplace. All right, that's it for today's MyShell tutorial. I hope this guide has given you a solid understanding of what MyShell can do. If you want to learn more, visit our website or subscribe to our official channel. Thanks for watching.